Hey guys, 22 Plankster here. This is probably my number one requested thing to shoot this bulletproof class with. I've got here in front of me three different kind of um, shotgun slugs. Now these will be fired out of a rifled barrel. Uh, the first one up is the Hornady SST shotgun slug. And uh, these are 300 grain. So that's gonna you know, pack a pretty good punch. The second one I'm gonna be trying out is some Winchester golden partitions. And these are at 385 grain, and all these are three-inch mags. And last but not least, uh, the Black Magic Magnum. Uh, these are uh, Brennicky slugs. These things are unbelievable. I've seen some testing on on YouTube with these slugs. These things, you know, I don't know what these things are made out of. These these slugs, but they're almost as hard as diamonds. So if any of them has a chance to penetrate this bulletproof glass, it's going to be these guys. So I'm gonna back up at about 50 yards and uh, grab the 12 gauge and see if they'll go through this bulletproof class. All right, first up, the Hornadies. Nice. All right, second, the Winchesters. Wow, that Winchester pops a little bit of punch. Last but not least, the Brennicky slugs. Let's go take a look. All right, first things first. Right here was the shot with the Hornady. Uh, now this is considered a deer slug. I was very surprised that with that ballistic tip and hitting something hard, that it actually went all the way through the glass. I was very surprised with that result. The second one down here, the Winchester, uh, that one went plumb through it too. I couldn't believe it. And the one that I actually expected to go through the bulletproof glass, the Brennicky, it stopped cold in its tracks. You can actually see right about here, a part of the slug that is still sticking out of this bulletproof glass. So it did not go all the way through. I know these two shots were pretty close together. If this Brennicky would have went through, I'd have reshot it. But since it didn't go through, there's no need to reshoot it because the glass was already a little weak right here in this area. Guys, thank you very much for watching. If you have any other idea what you want me to shoot this bulletproof glass with next, put it in the comments below. Until next time, y'all be safe and keep blinking.